What's up guys, it's your boy Wheaton here, back with another video, and today we are back on Madden 20 Ultimate Team. In today's video, we are going to be doing a Legend Fantasy Pack opening. Uh, my coins are running a little bit low, gotta get them coins up, so I figure I might as well open some packs. But before we get into the pack opening, let me shout out a few comments first. Comment comes from AFK Delaws. They commented, you're a good player and a good YouTuber. I appreciate the support. But what I appreciate even more is that you say I'm a good Madden player. I take that, man. Thank you. Not a lot of people be saying that, man. Thank you. And then this is going to be a compilation of a few comments of just people answering the question I asked last video, which was, what NFL player would you add to your favorite team if you could? And the first one came from Fruitless Nova. They commented, Patty Mahomes on my Steelers. Then I Snore Baker commented, I'd put either D-Hop or Julio on the Packers. Orbit Norbit said I would put Jalen Ramsey on my Texans because we would actually have a lockdown corner. Your boy Sparky said Bobby Wagner on my Ravens. There was a bunch of you guys answering that question, but I got a better one today. The question for today is, if you could take one player from your team's past and add them to your current roster right now, who would it be? For example, all you guys know, I'm a fan of the Green Bay Packers. I mean, you can see it literally everywhere. If I could add a past player to this current roster we have right now, I would probably add the great Reggie White. Um, My reasoning is we obviously have two great edge rushers in Darius Smith and Preston Smith, but he was just so dominant. I would probably add him. All you guys right now, comment down below what past player from your team you would add. These are going to be good. But without further ado, man, let's open these packs. I was looking around the pack market. They have these sidekick bundles, and they have, like, the team of the week junks. Like, I could buy this team of the week bundle. I could buy this sidekick bundle. But I think I'm just going to stick with the classic Legend Fantasies. I think I'm going to scoop this bundle real quick five times. All right, boys, let's get into these packs. This is the first pack, but we got to start out with the bang. How you know a pack opening is going to be good is if the first pack starts out good. If the first pack starts out hot, you're going to have a good pack opening. So you got to set the tone here. Nothing but gold so far in the second round. Okay, there we go. A little legend. 84 Anthony Munoz. All right, so we got one elite in the second round. Not too bad. All right, now this third round. This is where we get the money. This is where you get your money. So far, two small legends, another small legend, another small legend. 85 Brian Dawkins, honestly, isn't too bad. I mean, I wouldn't say it's a bang, but it could have been worse. <laughs> Obviously got nothing in the first round. What do we got in the second round here? 76 Taylor Luan, Mike Evans, Elite, Trey Flowers. Anything else? Any other elites? No more elites. I'll take that, though. Any elite in the second round, I will take. We got a fantasy card here. Team of the week, 83, Marlon Mack. Got another legend, 84, Kevin Green. Another small legend. And, oh, big legend, 89, Jim Brown. There we go, man. That is a good pull. I don't know how, he, how much he is, but he's got to be a lot. I think he's new, too. There we go, EA. There's a banger pull. I need a few more of those. Give me, like, two more of those. And it will be good. I don't know how much he goes for. I'm hoping for the best. He could be 50K, could be 200. I have no clue. Second round, first round actually gave us a few gold. So that means, oh, oh, Mutt superstar thing. Billy Turner. Mutt hero, I meant to say my bad. Actually, he's having a really good year so far with the Packers. What is that? Is that a veteran? It is a veteran. 85 Brandon Marshall. Dude, the animations this year are amazing, EA. I would just like to point that out. The animations are way better than last year. Oh, we got Team of the Week. 84, Deshaun Shedd. Okay, a legend. And then another legend. I don't know who goes for the most here. I gotta look it up on my head. All right, boys, just looked it up. At the current moment, Deshaun Shedd's 30K. Erlach is like 35. And T.O. is actually 40. It's a good thing I looked it up because I would have lost a smooth 10K. Hey, 10K is not a lot. But I will take any coins I can get. So, T.O., welcome to the team. If we can just get, like, one more of those, like, 89, 90 overall guys, that'll be, I'm, that'll be perfectly fine. We got another Mud Hero, 80 Jordan Jenkins. I'm going to be honest, I don't know who that is, but I will gladly take you. All right, elite round, we got another Vikings Elite. Small legend, big legend, 87, dang it. Uh, I mean, it's still not bad. It's still not bad, but 
when you see that big legend flare, you just like you get all hype and you think it's gonna be like a 92 or 93, like full legend, and then you get 87. Like I'll take it though. Like I'm not complaining, but I am complaining. Under the last legend fantasy pack we have, we gotta end it on a banger. We need a full legend here. No like 89s, no none of that. We need 92s. We need full legends. Another mutt hero. 80 overall, Montez Sweat. I bet you he is so fast. I gotta look at that. All right, no, no other elites in the pack, but can I look at uh, this boy stats real quick? 86 speed, are you kidding me? This card is a beast. All right, final elite round. Come on, boys. Okay, 84 Eddie Jackson. Small legend flair. Small legend flair. 84 Allen Page. I'm gonna look up who is the most. I think Eddie Jackson might be the most, but I gotta just make sure. I have to look at Mudhead, they all sell for the most, so I'm just gonna pick Alan Page. Alright boys, if you look here, we got 11 total elites in our pack opening, which is not bad, I guess. We got 5 packs, 11 elites, that's over 2 a pack, so that's alright. But, they really, none of them are that great except for these two. These two are should be our money makers. If I had to guess, because I haven't looked, I think this Larry Allen might be 50 maybe i don't know i i don't think he's really that much and this jim brown i'm hoping is like a hundred maybe like 120 that's what i'm hoping that's where my predictions hopefully i don't look like a clown and i'm somewhat right let's look at this larry allen oh god I, i'm gonna be disappointed i already know i am okay actually no i'm not 70k i am not disappointed thank you oh my god i thought he would be like 50. That gives me a lot of hope for this Jim Brown. I was hoping this Jim Brown would be like 100. If 87 Larry Allen, who's been out since day one, is 70, this Jim Brown might be a lot more than I thought. Moment of truth. Whew, okay. Come on, boys. What do we got? 120. Isn't that what I guessed, right? I guessed 100 to 120. Okay. That's not too bad. That's really not too bad. So that's about 390k thousand coins we got in our all of our pulls, give or take, because obviously I'm rounding up and down just to make the math easier. Plus, you gotta remember there is Madden taxes that take, I think, 10%. So really 390 is probably about 350. Alright, boys, so I know you guys are thinking, where did your face cam go? Well, this is after everything you just seen, like all, all, all the packs you just saw, all me explaining everything after all that. This is after everything. I have made an executive decision to sell the 89 Jim Brown, sell this 87 Larry Allen, sell this 85 Tyrone Smith, and then everything else, I'm going to quick sell. Now you might think, why would you do that? What what do you gain from that? See, and that's a great question. You know, you know what I gained from that? Six thousand training. Boom. Random ninety and ninety one overall. Mutt hero. The cards that just came out. Honestly, I don't even know a lot of the cards that came out. I just know there's an Adam Thielen, a David Johnson, a Kyle Fuller, JJ Watt. I know. After that, I don't know a lot of them, but I'm gonna I'm, I'm open this and I'm gonna pull one of those big boy ones, one of those good ones, one of those JJ Watts. So everyone, stand up, get off your feet. I know you're on your bed right now watching this video. Stand up, get on your feet. I'll give you a second to get on your feet. Let's go, man, come on. Give me some good, give me some good. That animation is sick. 90 Brandon Cooks, that's not bad. Oh, that's not bad at all. 90 overall Brandon Cooks, we take a look at the stats. Obviously that 91 speed jumps at you. That is a fast man. Catching stats are actually pretty good. Route running is actually surprisingly really good. Now this card looks amazing. All you guys right now that want to see me use this Brandon Cooks, debut this Brandon Cooks card, make him look like a stud out there on the field. I need you guys to comment down right now and say, hey, debut them in your next Mutt Roulette episode. Because if you guys want me to, I will use my I will use upgrade points in my next Mutt Roulette episode to make sure we debut this 90 Brandon Cooks in that passing heavy offense I like to run in Mutt Roulette. But anyway, on to the outro where you can actually see me again.
That is going to be the end of the video, boys. I hope you guys do enjoy. Packs were pretty decent today. Could have been worse. Could have been a little bit better, but I will take it. Like I said earlier in the video, make sure to comment down below which player from your team's past would you add to your current roster right now. Mutt draft video hopefully will be out tomorrow whenever this video is uploaded right after. If not, it should be within the next few days. I promise you guys, so stay tuned for that. I'll see you guys in the next video.